Alright, what is up? I have Forsaken. Forsaken, please, Greek Angel. Don't have one. Don't have one. Don't win, Greek Angel. Lose, Greek Angel. Um, I have Forsaken single player mode of this game. Y'all see the video eventually. But it's my last video y'all will ever see of any kind of single players of Unlimited Mars. And the reasoning behind that is actually, yes, Greek Angel lost. Leave, Greek Angel. Get the fuck out here with your one bar. Sorry, you can maybe see me in the reflection. I'm raising my hands in triumph. But that may not be a bad thing. It should. He should have waited to lose so that I would not have to play him immediately afterward if I happened to win. But anyway, I'm forsaken single player mode basically because, like, this finally made me realize. Like, not really realize it. Like, I always knew it, but I never really thought about it, like, to put it into words. Of why I hate single player modes in fighting games. And it's that the AI isn't intelligent. The AI isn't teaching, like, forcing you to play better. It's basically just the developers gave them a bunch of cheap shit and told inside of their AI, yo, use this cheap shit as often as possible because you can read their inputs. And that's why, like, trying to play, like, arcade mode or abyss mode or something, or any of the single player modes to try and actually learn the game is utterly terrible. Like, trying to learn how to hit confirm properly, how to recognize your hit confirms and to follow that up into correct combos that's fine but trying to like learn footsies learn good movement what the heck speaking of good movement what the fuck are these people doing uh, all of that stuff like it's utterly useless single player is useless for that and that was very very obvious when playing goddamn unlimited mars when obviously they give the unlimited characters even more dumb bullshit than normal so yeah, we're done with saying why does she get to do three of those in one combo? Where is my same move proration shit at? Nice air throw, no well. Beat up this Ragna. For some reason I suck against Ragna. I don't know why. I always have. Doesn't matter what character I'm using, I've just always sucked against Ragna. Could have blown that that's so easy to blow up. Like, if he, he could have easily used one of Noel's invincible moves to kill that. Oh, and now you done lost. Oh, never mind. At least he forced burst. Oh, he would have won. And now he does win. Damn it, Noel. You had that shit! Play your character better, god damn it! Oh man, looking at this dude's, uh. The Ragna player's game attack made me remember. This morning was such a disappointment. This morning, I was like, just for shits and giggles, I didn't think I was going to find anybody playing because it was very early. But I, was, I didn't have anything else to do. You know, I'm caught up on all my schoolwork. I didn't have anything to do. So I was like, you know, look, let's go hop online and see if maybe I can find some people to play. You know, like, let's get some more experience. I haven't played much. I think I've only played, like, 50 matches or total online. Maybe even less than that. Like, I have not been playing this as much as I should be trying to get experience. So I come online, and I'm like, I, the first thing I do is check lobbies. There's not, there's a shit ton of Japanese lobbies, but there's nothing that's actually saying, yo, you have a good connection here. Get in that ass. Nothing. So I go and I hop into the other, whatever the fuck the other one is called. Actually, I think that one, the other one is called lobbies, now that I think of it. Like, those are just player matches. And then the lobby system is the one where you actually go to join, where, like, there's a maximum of 64 people allowed or whatever. So then I go to the lobby system, and for the first time ever, I see that there's actually some separation in the U.S. maps. There's actually, like, there were, like, 40 people or something like that. Actually, I think it was closer to 30 in the East Coast room. And then there was a West Coast room that had 14 people in it. And I was like, oh, my God. Is this actually separated into region? Am I actually going to catch some West Coast people that I can play against that I don't have godlike connections with? Oh my god, I'm so excited. This is the first time this has happened. Let's go. I'm gonna play some peoples. So I go join the lobby. It's all Japanese players. <laughs> like, the chat and everything is all a shit ton of, you know, Japanese text. Oh my god, he actually blocked it, but he didn't punish it. Oh, uh, how did you not punish that? Damn it, Noel! Yes, Noel! Yes, Noel! Yes, Noel! You're my favorite. Yeah, it was all Japanese players. Every single one of them. 
Like, the, it didn't even come up that there were zero bar connections in the little, like, menu that you can check to select it. It was all zero bar connections. I mean, no, I mean, it didn't even show you the connection. It was one of those things where, like, it was taking it so damn long to figure out how bad the connection was. It just gave up midway. It was like, nah, it's, it's too bad. They can't even put this into bars. It's that bad. Just leave. So I did. Damn, I'm kind of mad the Ragnar- No, Ragnar player, that was a four bar connection! I don't get to see those often enough. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, we got a Relius? This is the first Relius I've seen, I believe. You know what I'm actually really surprised about? Actually, I'm not surprised at all. Now that I like, actually really think about it. But I haven't seen any of the, like, the, the, big, the big three. The big three of this game. Talkaka, Valkenhayn, Lychee. I've seen a couple Lychees. There was that one Valkenhayn player that was playing Kokonoe and then switched to Valkenhayn and got destroyed by me. That's right, I'm godlike. <laughs> but no, that's the only Valkenhayn player I've seen. And I do not believe I have seen a single Taokaka. Ever. I just haven't seen one yet. Which is really surprising. Those are all like the best characters, but I see... The character variety in this game in general actually has not, is basically non-existent. Now that I'm like sitting here thinking about it, I see a lot of Ragnas, a lot of Jins, a lot of Noels. I see plenty of other Asriels, plenty of bullets. I've seen a decent amount of Coca Noe since she's come out. But nobody really nobody else. Like I'd say after them, Lychee's probably the one I've seen the most of, and that's barely any. We're gonna take a look. Well actually I think there's still another match before I get to play. This is why I don't usually join these lobbies. I can't, I don't, I don't like to wait. I mean, ideally, I should get something else to do in the middle of these, so that, like, the wait isn't excruciating, because I don't particularly care about watching these matches, because let's be honest. And it's the same thing when I'm up to, you know, there's nothing special about watching me. Thank you guys for actually watching me, but there's nothing special about me playing. I'm not, you know, you're not going to learn anything new from me. There are all kinds of videos already up there of Japanese players far better than me that you will learn more from the gameplay, so it's kind of the same thing, right? I'm not really going to learn anything about matchups by watching this. I've learned by playing. And so obviously when I'm here, I want to fucking play. I don't want to sit here and watch six matches before I get to play. So that's why I usually don't join these lobbies, and that sucks too, because most of the people that I have good connections with join these lobbies. Because that's the region. Both of these people... I mean, obviously, this is the finest KO room. This is Koopa. I know Koopa personally. He's never actually here to play the bastard. But he only lives about an hour away from me. Well, obviously, I'm going to have a good connection with him. And then the other one, the Brett Twitch, that guy is about an hour away from Koopa, so he's about two hours away from me. Oh, my God, that was the most punishable thing in the world, and you didn't punish it. Tisk tisk, Mr. Relius. Tisk tisk. So, I mean, they're both very close. I have good connections with both. And so, obviously, people are going to see that three-bar shit and just hop in here. And those are the people that are going to have good connections with me as well. But there's too many of them! And nobody ever joins my lobbies. I try to make lobbies of, like, three people or two people or four people, and nobody ever joins them. They always join the two bars, or the, I mean, not the two bars, the, um, the ones with, like, five, six-plus people in them. And I don't want that. I want to just play. Holy shit, we got a new 13. This is all kinds of crazy right now. I haven't seen one of her either. I hope this person doesn't win, because if she does, you all going to see a depressing display on my part. Because this character is weird as hell, and you cannot bullshit this matchup. You got to know this matchup. But I don't really want to play against Noel either. Noel have special intros with fucking everybody? Actually, that might not be a special intro. That might have just been one I've never seen before. Oh, you just got blown out, New 13. Oh, you're fucked now, New 13. Bo 
bugs me that she can do like three of those in one combo. It really does. Beyond belief. Ooh, that should have been punished. Ooh, that should have been... That was a bad overhead. Ooh, this connection looks bad. Ooh, yeah, that looks terrible. That 686 damage fatal counter. You go, girl. Does she have to be in that mode to get that 5C move? This new mode is, I believe this is Lambda mode. I think. And the one she starts in is new mode. So does new not have that 5C move? Yeah, that was a bad burst. This person has a lot to learn about zoning. I don't think they hit with like a single one of their projectiles. Yep, lot to learn about Zomi. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> I mean, New is very, like, as far as I'm aware, New is very Dalsimish. And that, like, she can make it very, very, well, she should make it extremely difficult for anybody to get in. Dear Lord, don't get perfect with New. Please, yes! No! Where was the confirm? Into the corner! Into the corner pressure! No! Yeah, you should've just let that rock. I cannot believe that just worked. Yeah. So much to learn about zoning. Wow. Alright, Nate. Time for you to win. Time for you to show your prowess. With Monsieur Azrael, Azrael, I need to, I need to, I need to start pronouncing it correctly. It's Azrael. I need to just go through and like listen to every just character select every single character in the game and just listen to how it's pronounced. Because I know I pronounce a bunch of stuff incorrectly. Y'all get to see the new colors. Well, you kind of saw the new color. Already in that one video where I was wondering why the hell the unblockable wasn't unblockable. Thank you for answering that. But it makes it a high and a low at the same time so you can't utilize it against jumping opponents. Alright, that's enough of that. No, well, you need a longer skirt. That's not gonna fly. She should get a penalty because she's gonna be so damn cold. Ah, what the shit? That sucks. Fuck! Oh, that sucks too. Yeah, that was a terrible idea. She could have reversal that, no problem. She could have hit like any button and that would have beat it. Okay, so this person's is a bad connection. How'd that miss? Damn it, Azrael. Your anti air suck. Why does all that work? It bugs me that all that works. Yeah. I have no idea why I hit a button. That was stupid of me to hit a button. Ah! Don't.
Don't lose in this connection, bro. Don't lose in the connection. Fuck you. What? Dude, that's stupid. Yo, why did the second B come out? I hit the button once. Okay, hopefully this was that person. Well, shit. We're not even gonna get to, like, actually test if that was this person's connection. Because next, we got the one bar connection next. Shit. Shit. I didn't even use... See, like, the thing is, is, like, my neutral... Not my neutral game, my... Uh, damn, they dropped down to a two bar connection and that shit. All right. Fingers crossed. Don't be terrible. Um, the... My block strings. My block strings are incredibly just, like, ingrained in my mind at this point. And so because of that, I'm not running the mix-up that I should be. And I need to, I need to stop that. I need to, I need to make a focused effort to stop doing what I am doing and use tighter block strings that allow me a wider variety of mix-up. But I'm not. I keep doing the same shit. And the problem with that same shit is all of it can be mashed out of. Like, if you just sit there and let me run wild on you, I'm gonna run wild on you. I'm gonna get hits. You're not gonna block it off. But you can just hit buttons in the middle of it and it'll beat me. And that is the downside of my offense at the moment. Which I gotta fix. Bang, you take too fucking long. Sorry, bro. Bad, bad confirm. This dude real? Why did I hate? Fuck you, stay in the corner. Oh, so he's really he's really gonna mash those? Okay. Alright, if you really wanna mash B D moves, you can go for it, dude. Pretty sure I'm gonna blow that up. Oh, nope. Yo, how did I not get that air grab? Ah, this dude just random me out. Darn it. Okay, yeah, this connection's awful. Yeah, alright, so I need to I need to just let this person mash. Okay, I didn't want an anti air. This dude, yeah, this dude's randoming me out so terribly. Yo, that lag right there, that was cool. That's not gonna hit. Yeah. I got randomed out in a bad connection, sorry. That sucks. Ah. <sighs> Should have known that would happen. It's what I can see. That's why I don't join these rooms. Like they don't. There's to, their connections are far too random. I can't be guaranteed to play in a good connection, and there's no good, viable reason to play in bad connections. Like the majority of the time in connections like that, I just let them win. I don't even bother playing. So that sucks. See, like same thing. These are the lobbies that are always available, and all the people that I have good connections with join those lobbies. 
and it's fucking terrible. Because every single time, there's always one or two people in the lobby that have just shitty, terrible connections. That's it? Really? 14 people? They have terrible connections, and everybody plays them, and then like me, after playing them, they're like, you know, there's no reason to stick around and play in connections like that. Screw that. I'm out. And they leave. And so I'm stuck with the bad connections. All the good people leave. And I'm stuck with bad connections like that where I just end up getting randomed out by that dude. Please select your character. It sucks, so what can you do? Holy crap, we actually got an Amane. Let's see if this person actually can play. I played one Amane previous to this. And the only thing they did was use like that special... I don't know what it actually was, but it was kind of dive kick -esque. Like, they kind of barrel down at you in a diagonally downwards manner and then hit you and then go forward a little bit more. That's all they did. Like, that's literally the only thing they did. They did nothing else. So I have zero Amane experience. Okay, 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 I okay, can't hold up. Damn, this person actually knows what the hell they're doing. I cannot believe all that missed. This person knew what they were doing until they got hit by Asriel. <laughs> oh, you poor thing. You poor little cross dressy you. Oh shit, alright. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know I mean I don't know anything about this character's neutral game. I cannot believe that missed. Really? I didn't get my jump? I didn't even do anything there. Like, that was... This person just, had, just has no clue how to fight or how to block Azrael. They didn't have a clue how to block Asriel, and unfortunately they picked a character that has to block. And that's... I ran roughshod on them without doing anything that deserved being hit by. Sorry. I mean, the good thing is, is that obviously I'm getting better with my combos. I have better combos. The thing I need to really significantly work on at this point is hit confirming crouching opponents into 3C. That's the thing that I need to do a lot of, because I am catching people who are trying to do, like, two A's or two B's, you know, whatever. They try to hit me, and I counter hit them crouching, and then I just go into my normal, regular combo. I don't use 3C, and I need to. That's my biggest problem at this point in time. But my otherwise, I'm getting a lot better with my combos, and it's just, uh... My, my setups. I need better setups. I need better block strings that lead into better mix-up than I'm using currently. But yeah, this is the first person I've ever seen actually like try to level up drills with Amani, so that's cool. Yo, shout out to that backdash. Yo, damn. How did that miss? Cannot believe that missed. Oh, 
God damn it. My fault. My fault. My fault. Bad blocking. Bad blocking. Damn it. I don't think that's going to kill him, but we'll see. <laughs> oh, Azrael, you silly motherfucker. I got a backdash, yay! I'm the best! Damn it, I'm not the best! Holy shit, what the hell poke was that? Ow. That's what I get for pressing the button. Yo, where the fuck was my poke? Damn it! Jesus Christ! I'm surprised those drills aren't punishable. Nope, nope! Fuck you! Ah! What? What? What the shit? Alright, yeah, that was bad. That was bad on my part. That sucks. Damn it. Huh? Oh, where was the beat? Oh my god. I, 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 no, 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 no. You back the fuck up. You back the fuck up. <laughs> fuck your drills. Nope. Fuck your drills. Fuck your drills. Damn it. Yo, what the hell? That was confusing. Apparently, I can't do a quarter circle back. I tried. I only got one of them out. I tried like three times. But I need to do that now. I need to, I haven't, for some reason, I haven't thought of that. But those drills have to be projectiles. So Asriel could probably blow up those setups. The only thing that is that I would have to see, I would have to pay attention to, is um, whether or not it still gives him levels. Because it would be like Izioi. Like, Izioi, if you absorb her projectiles, she still gets the points off of that, like, as if you would block them. So that's the thing that I have to pay attention to. That would actually be hella fucking dirty if Amane doesn't even get levels off of those while I'm absorbing them. Thanks like, for the free flanks cannon, screw your setups. I mean, they could probably drop another drill at the correct moment in time where I wouldn't be able to do another growler field. And then get still get the levels off of it, but yeah. I'm assuming I could probably absorb a full drill. And we'll just have to see after that whether or not they get levels. Hopefully they don't, but that'd be hella cheap and bad for, you know, saddening for Imani. But we must know. Oh fuck, that was supposed to be a backdash, not a backdash, a back turn. Oh damn. What? How is that not a counter hit? Damn it to hell! Oh really? Yeah, see I did just absorb that one. I still didn't get the damn 2B. Shit! Oh, video's about to end. Sorry! This sucks. <laughs> 